Hey guys, Jen here from Craft Penguin Planner. Welcome to my channel. Today we are planning another week in my little mini notebook um, from the penny pages. We're going to do some more journaling um, spreads in here. And um, I've pulled out a bunch of little samplers that have been in my stash. Some of them have probably been in my stash for a couple of years. So um, just know that um, I don't know how long I've had these, they could be from anywhere, anytime. So, um, if the shops are still around, I will try to find them and link them below. Um, if not, well, unfortunately, you know, it is what it is. So we're, we're, we're just going to jump in. I'm moving into fall stuff because I want to, I'm ready to. I also pulled out over here, um, because I have some journaling type stickers. I think we're going to use those date covers. Just because why not. And um, I can't tell you where most of those are from. Other than. Um, yeah. Alright. Um, let's just dive right in. I'm going to. Um, let's use a planner with Manny one first. I, I'm ready for fall. The temperatures have started to cool down a little bit here we're around 80 degrees now instead of um i had another one of these samplers clearly that i had already put in here so i have some of these little um acorns as well um but it's still warm but it's cooled oh Wow, that one just popped right off. It has cooled way down. Um, so now we're only around 80 degrees for the week, which is really nice. We also don't have the humidity that we've been having. So I'm excited. I'm very, very excited um, about fall coming because I am, I'm nuts about fall. I uh, love me some fall. Um, you know, we can use this. Um, oh, I should have used this tomorrow. I mean, on the second one, on Tuesday, because today is Tuesday, and I'm going to be doing a little bit of um, planning today, because clearly I'm filming this, and I'm, oh, well. It's all good, so we're going to be done with that one. I'm going to hold on to those sheets again. For now, like I said, um, like I did last time, so that way I can locate and um, do, uh, guys, my brain and mouth are not working together. That way I can find all the shops and link them down below. There you go. One day done. So... Let me tell you about, oh, this might get interesting. I have a, hold on, let me pull this clip off of here because, you know, it make it kind of bumpy right there. Let, let's see, which one do I want to grab next? Let's go with Pink Vivis. Is that how we say it? Illustration Pink Vivis, I think is how you say it. But, um, Saturday was kind of crazy. If you watched my um, daily plan with me, um, obviously I don't get through, you know, I pre-plan for Saturdays, but I don't actually get to tell you about Saturday because um, it happens after I plan. So, Saturday was kind of a um, wild ride when it came to being out delivering. Um, I started the day off getting a really good offer for Walmart Spark. It was like $66, $67, something like that. And... It was going down this direction towards where my house is. I'm like, that's fine, but you know, for the for the price, I'm like, yeah. 
it was a large shopping order. I will say that. So it took a good little while to shop, but the problem is that this is at the Supercenter Walmart and my Supercenter right now is rearranging the entire store. So with Walmart Spark, most of the time it is very easy to get in, get out because Spark literally lays it out. This is the aisle number, this is the modular number, and this is the placement on the shelf. Like, literally, it will show you exactly where it is on the shelf, basically, in the app. It gives you this, this, that, you know, three things. And if you know what to look for, it's easy to just bing, 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 and you're done. Um, and you can go right to the item. You, but when they're rearranging the entire store, li literally. Um, nothing is where it should be, and the app isn't updated for it. So, well, that's cute. Doesn't give me a lot of room to write today, but you know what? It's fine. All right, so two days down. Um, Let's pick, let's do this. Um, I have Sweet Tea Sticker Co. and Gilded Lily Stickers. I was thinking this pumpkin spice and everything nice would work really well with um, these. Clearly. So, I think that's what we're going to do. Is there anything else I wanted to add with that? Uh, I think I want to use that with the Scrappy Fox one. I could probably pull these in maybe somewhere. I don't know if I'm going to do it with this one or not. Let's just jump in and we'll see what happens. Um, so, yeah. Because they're rearranging the store, things are getting um, crazy. It literally took me almost two hours to shop that order. It was insane. Then I get it all. I finally get through. Oh, and that's the other thing. They have it where now on both sides, they have it where they make one line that kind of merges to the center. You have to stop and then it they send you to all the checkout lanes. I am doing spark. I think we're going to use a splat. I know this is from Cheerful Planner Girl. Um, um, of course, I'm doing Spark. So, because it's a Walmart order, I can kind of just jump to the front of the line and let them know that, hey, I have a Spark order. And, um they will send me on my way. Well, of course, you get the people who are like, uh, the line's way back there. I'm like, I'm aware of that. But I have a Walmart. I, I'm like, I have a spark order, which basically means, you know, I'm doing a job for Walmart. So, you know, of course, not, um, listening to them too much and I move on my way and kind of cut up there and just let them know when they send me through and all that no big deal um I get through the line I get everything done loaded up in my you know bagged loaded in my car and I pull off and I start heading to the customer when a message pops up on my app on my phone saying that the order has been canceled and to return to the store guys i just spent all this time shopping frustrated for it to for some reason get canceled and now i have to bring it back 
I, I was a little more than irritated to say the least. So I, um, it says to pull up at the, um, I don't think I'm going to use any more of this for this one, but, um, I'll keep that to the side. Anyways, that's kind of cute. Um, let's go with this one together with KX. Let's just, um, do that. Um, so yeah, you had to go pull up where like curbside pickup and all that is. So I pulled up in one of the slots and I happened to see one of the, the guys that were, you know, loading someone else. And I said, Hey, I'm not sure what I need to do. It told me to come pull over here with this. Um, I like literally just left the store and now it got canceled and I have to return it. And they're like, okay, no problem. I got you. And, um, so after he finished with loading up that one, um, customer, he came back with a cart and we unloaded my car and I'm like, they better pay me something because I just spent all this time going through the store, trying to find everything. Um, and like with everything like it is, he's like, yeah, he's like, I would be so mad. I said, I, I, I am. I'm like, it was a really good order too. So, um, he's like, they, they should pay you something. Oh man, my nose just suddenly started itching. So when all was said and done and I swiped and whatnot that it was returned and I checked my earnings, they, they paid me $31. Which is not even, you know, it, it could have been way worse. It could have been way worse. Um, let's just do that. I'll have plenty of room to write on Thursday. Don't know what I need to write about on Thursday that take that much space, but you never know. Um, let's do this one. We'll use the Scrubby Fox along with, I think I wanted to use these or some of those because the, the little sunflowers, I think that'll look really cute with that. Um, either I'm talking really slow or I'm just working really fast and not getting through telling you the things. What was I? Oh, I need to get, this is Friday already. Yeah, I'm working too fast for me talking anyways. So, yeah, um, I managed to get something out of it at least, which is good. But I just, I was not happy with the fact that I spent so much time shopping, trying to locate all the things, and then had to literally bring it right back. It was literally a waste of my time. But at least um, I got paid something and um, then immediately right after I turned DoorDash on, they sent me an Aldi order, which Walmart's here. There's some apartments right back here, right behind where Walmart is, and all these right here. So, literally, I didn't even have to go out to the main road. There's a side little street that comes kind of right here from Walmart out, and all these right there. So, I literally came out and went straight to Aldi and shopped that delivery, which also came down this direction. Um, Literally, like, less than a mile from my house. No big deal. Um, so I got that one done. And then drove back up that direction. Let's just put it randomly right there. Um, what does that say? 
Cocoa Break. I'm trying to read the book, what the book title says, but it's so small because it's such a little thing that even with good eyes, it's hard to see. Um, I just, I feel like um, one of these little characters needs to um, make its way on here, even if I, I don't need the um, that one on here, so we'll save it for something else. But I feel like some of these just need um, to join the party here. And I guess I'll save these other ones for something else because this is cute. Although I kind of want to put... I don't know if I can do it. Um, But yeah, from there, I literally kept going back up towards the, you know, the hot spot area and um, getting sent right back down towards my house all day. I had a couple of shop and deliver orders and they all got sent this way. One of them literally was a stacked order where both picked up at Food Lion, but guess what? It wasn't the Food Lion up in the area where I was. It's the Food Lion literally around the corner from my house. The one I go to all the time. Let's do this one with the Modest Cat. Um, and maybe, oh, if I can get it off the sheet without ripping it. There you go. Um, maybe we can pull in some of those other little stickers I could use that with that too there's another like orangey one I could probably use those pull those in um put that sweater I mean it's like a sweatery pattern I would have loved to do like a sweater weather type one but I could use some of these red even maybe that. I don't know. I'm being indecisive now. Um, Cause I want to use that for Sunday, but I could pull in maybe those oranges for Sunday. So we'll save those ones. Maybe we'll pull some of that in. All right. Um. But. Yeah, I literally kept being sent down this way. I got that one uh, that stacked for Food Lion down here. And then I think there was another one when I went up there. It was just a short run of like, um, I think I did a short uh, Chick-fil-A one that was just right around the corner. And then, yeah, I got sent back down this way. That's what it was. I got sent down here with a Jersey Mike's order. $17 for Jersey Mike's. I'm like, somebody wants their Jersey Mike's. But it, it kind of went a little further past my house, which is, it's fine. I um, am okay with that. At that point, I was like, yeah, I'm going to just call it quits because there's no point in um, me driving all the way back up there for like an hour or less. You know what I mean? So it just kind of, um, it worked itself out. It was a good day overall, though, despite the spark incident that just, oh my goodness. That really annoyed me. I kind of feel like I need to just add a little something over here and maybe this little basket of apples. And maybe we'll just splash that there. That looks good. All right, cool. See, I'm just playing with this. I don't have a an idea of what's gonna happen when I sit down with this. It's literally me just um, grabbing what I can and deciding 
when I sit here to do this, this is how it's going to be. I don't really have set plans on these when I um, sit down for this. But that's kind of part of the fun and joy of this is it's random. I, I wanted to use this, I think, for Sunday just because I am kind of tired. And on by Sunday, I'm wiped out. And I thought the take it easy is um, just, you know, perfect. Do you want to put the sloth here or the sloth here? I was thinking here, but now I think it's going to go here. And then I had this other little sampler that just had some fall stuff on it. So I thought maybe, okay, that'll be good there. Maybe these would be kind of cute to sprinkle around. I just don't, I don't know when I had these from, I do know Cheerful Planner Girl is no longer open. So, you know, hers is one shop I can't link. I, I will save the dog walking and... Nixie sleeping and the other one for another day um, for something else but um, yeah honestly I think that's it I don't think I have anything else I want to add and I think this is I think it looks good I could probably sprinkle do I want to try to see if I can lift this up and layer this just because it's fine either way all right so we're gonna call it good um this turned out really cute hold please don't don't want um like what happened last time um where i almost showed you all my writing you don't need to see my little journaling but yeah i really love how this turned out I really am enjoying doing this little mini journal so here's just a another flip through of the little spreads we created I wish I had more something I could add in here on that one but I just I didn't so it's fine it's cute either way and um so which day is your favorite I kind of like them all but I don't know. I love these. I love that. I mean, like, I love them all. What can I say? They're all cute. I just am enjoying doing this little um, mini journal right now. And hopefully, I'll be able to keep up with it. Um, finding samplers that are still intact to do this is starting to actually be proving difficult because I've been organizing my stickers, but... That just means it may end up coming into things like this where I just start pulling from here and my other one with the decos and stuff like that. So we'll see how it progresses over time. But there you go. That is my little week. I will go back and fill in yesterday um, now that this is laid out and then continue from there. So if you enjoyed this, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.